It's how we get through the sun pass lanes, how we get into a secure building, and how we pay at checkout. It's called Radio Frequency Identification Technology, or RFID. It's a chip like this one, which communicates using radio waves in credit and debit cards with this logo on it, making it faster and easier to make purchases, but also making it easier for thieves to steal your information. As a criminal, what you can do is that you can walk by someone if you have an RFID reader, and you can scan the data that's in there. Detective Ricardo Arias is part of the Miami Electronic Crime Task Force with the Secret Service. He says it takes two pieces of technology for thieves to steal your information, a card scanner, which you can find online for as little as $20, and a hacking software that breaks the encryption on the credit cards. That software also available online. I mean, it's just too easy. Everything's too easy. It would be frightening, though. It makes me feel like there's definitely room for improvement. So yes, some experts say that with the right software, you can get my personal information off my credit card. But we discovered something even more alarming, and it has to do with this. And this software can be downloaded for free from anywhere. U.S. passports issued after 2006 also have an RFID chip embedded inside the back cover. FIU engineering professor Fasal Colleen says if your passport falls into the wrong hands, it can be passed around the world within minutes. I'm going to actually just put your passport over here. Okay, it's reading. And within a few seconds, your Gosh. passport with your passport number, with your nationality, with your date of birth, and every single thing appears right on that particular screen. That is scary. And nowadays, all these terrorists, I mean, do you think that they travel with their real identity over there? No. While some experts say there have not been any cases involving RFID technology, others say that's because it's untraceable. How would you know? It's nameless, it's faceless, so the best thing we can do is, is to, to know about it. I think you are less likely to fall victim to scams or to some of the latest technology if you're aware of it and you take steps to maybe utilize that same technology to protect yourself. While there have not been reported cases in South Florida yet, it's still smart to make sure you're protected. Passport and credit card sleeves, along with wallets and cases, are available online and claim to protect your personal information from being hacked. We've posted some of those links on our website, NBCMiami.com. We've also posted four major credit card companies' responses to the RFID technology. Just search in our news links. Nathalie Pozo, NBC Miami.